Hi everybody, it's Mayor Betsy back with you today. I want to provide the latest update to Fort Worth residents and businesses. We're posting this video with two clarifying documents. First is a copy of our updated emergency declaration that will go into effect at midnight tonight. And the second is an explanation document that breaks down mandatory social distancing protocols. I know this is a very unsettling time we are living through. I once again want to reiterate how proud I am of Fort Worth community for stepping up to help others. But we have to take additional actions because this is a deadly serious virus that is especially life-threatening for seniors and those with compromised immune systems. The City of Fort Worth Emergency Response Team is comprised of public health professionals but we are also consulting with experts at institutions like UT Southwestern, UNT Health Science Center, and all of our major healthcare networks. Right now, we are formalizing a team of health experts to continue advising us on this very fluid situation. We must flatten the curve on this virus to allow our hospital systems to maintain the level of care that all of you deserve. Currently, our hospital capacity is extremely limited because of folks in hospital beds with other illnesses. This afternoon, I will hold a press conference along with Tarrant County Judge Glenn Whitley and Arlington Mayor Jeff Williams. I felt it was important to get this information to you all now on the actions that the city is taking. There are additional mandatory social distancing protocols. I know these are incredibly difficult times and it's not lost on me that there are businesses facing going out of business and hardworking people who have lost their jobs. But we are taking these actions based on the advice from public health and medical experts and in accordance with the direction from the CDC. Here are the updated actions by the City of Fort Worth. Bars and restaurants will be takeout and deliver only, no dine-in option. We are limiting public gatherings to no more than 50 people. Retail establishments will remain open, but must reduce their occupancy rates to 50% of their occupancy code. We are closing the following business establishments, bars, lounges, taverns, amusement businesses, theaters, gyms, and private clubs. These establishments are closing based on several factors, including close proximity of patrons and guidelines from the CDC. Take a look at the documents that we are posting with this video. Please continue to practice social distancing. Only go out when absolutely necessary and talk to our younger generations about heeding the same warnings. The city will continue with our Facebook Live updates at 6 p.m. every day. Stay tuned for those two. We will continue to broadcast updates via the city's cable news. Please check on your neighbors and your friends this is uncharted territory, and it will take all of us working together to bring our community and the entire country to keep this virus from escalating dramatically. Together, we can prevent more suffering and save lives. Thank you for caring.